education project going on downtown. Last night, the mayor paid me a visit and gave me an ultimatum. Either pay hundreds of thousands of dollars to renovate my shop according to their dictates, or lose my shop. It's as simple as that. So I got in contact with the lawyer, and he suggested a grassroots campaign to petition the county council to stop this. So I've been all over town today to get signatures on my petition. Here's a copy of the petition I'll be sending to the county council. Read it over, and if you care to sign, here's my list. How many signatures do you have? Oh, several hundred. I'd be glad to sign it. They shouldn't have to go to your own business. Me too. I've been going to your place to learn to walk. Thank you very much. I think that'll make a big difference. I'd be glad to sign too, Tony. Will you be able to come to our services tomorrow? Maybe. Well, and please come to our Christmas program tonight. Well, it's a time to celebrate. And it's also a time to examine why Jesus came to earth as a baby. Why he would come to earth as a man. It's a mystery, I guess. <laughs> well, it would be, Tony. But the fact is, he told us why he came. To show us the path of life. To pay the penalty for our sin. Tony, remember when we talked when I first came to the church? Yes, Pastor. It was right after my wife passed away. You were really searching back then. You expressed some real concern about your soul to me. I haven't forgotten you. And I'm still praying that you'll accept the Lord. Okay, Pastor. I'll come tonight. Great. I know Angela would love it. Hello, Leonard. Good to see you. Will you be able to come to our Christmas program tonight? Our uh, teens are reading scripture, our little ones are singing, and our choir is preparing some special numbers, and we'll have a short message. I'd love to come, but i got to stay up late tonight. Some unexpected business has come up during the afternoon Jubilee program. Maybe next year. Tony, can I talk to you? Yes, Mr. Mayor. Thanks for your help, Pastor. You're welcome. See you tonight. Hopefully. What are you trying to do, Tony? I don't know what you're talking about. This petition, your stupid signatures, what are you trying to pull? You can't do this. I can and I will. I'm going to stop this renovation project of yours. No, you're not. You're not taking my store. I got a lawyer. You're not taking my store. It's my life. Tony, it's Christmas. I hate to do this to you, but I'm going to take your shit. The banks were closing your shop on Monday. You're way behind your mother's business. You, you scoundrel. I had nothing to do with it. You lost your store. I just stopped by to let you know that unless you pay your merchant to pull by Monday, your shop store is going to go up for auction. Just in time for Christmas, too. I won't let it happen. You're not the only one who works late. You do that. Just make sure you clean up the rat hole before you leave.
program tonight, and if you will open up your bulletin this evening, please join us for our Christmas sing-along. <laughs> 